Everyman Driver Nation, today we are saying goodbye to this Aegean Blue 2017 Honda Civic SI and saying hello to this burnished copper 2017. This is a Kia Sportage SX all-wheel drive. Now, a couple of things as we say goodbye to this one, just to give you a little recap because I've already done my review on it. This has a 1.5 liter turbocharged four-cylinder. The first time an SI has had a turbocharged. This is the eighth iteration of this vehicle, built on the 10th generation Civic platform. So a couple of stats for you, but I'll have the, all the information on my um, detailed review. I drove it, talked about some of the cool stuff on the instrument cluster. It has 205 horsepower, 18 inch uh, summer tires, performance tires. That's pretty cool, right? Uh, it does have the lane watch on it, which is going away. Uh, I explained that in the review. So let's go ahead and say hello to this Sportage, which I remember going down to San Diego and doing a video on this when they first launched, but that was a while ago. So. Let's open it up and take a, a quick look at it, what it has to offer. By the way, that uh, Honda Civic Si has limited safety features around it because it's more of an enthusiast car and they've kind of just bypassed that. Hey, go with the Civic, but if you want to have some more fun performance, this one's the way to go. Okay, here we go. Uh, let's go ahead and push button start. I say some of that... Uh, uh, safety stuff because I can see here blind spot warning like a lane keeping a lane departure warning here in that side Cruise control Bluetooth here on the left hand side. Oh This has got paddle shifters and the uh, Civic over there SI has a six-speed manual transmission. This screen looks probably like it's a seven-inch screen Lots of knobs and buttons to play with, heated and ventilated seats. I like the ventilator because it shows it at 89 degrees outside. You can lock, what's that? Lock the all-wheel drive. Drive mode, show Eco Sport. Uh, this looks like a hill descent. Yeah, downhill braking control. I don't know, do I take this off-road? Panoramic sunroof. Oh, one more. One more. There we go. Now we're going all the way back. Oh, oh, you can stop right there. Stop right there. Let's go ahead and go in the back seat as I show you some more of this. I'm trying to give you a, a wide angle lens here and what this looks like. There is your back seat. Looks pretty spacious. Just two rows, five passengers. How's it look for a guy who's 5'11", which is me? Check it out, brothers and sisters. Indent here in the seat back. It's about my position, I would say. I did move it and rearrange it in the driveway, so I think it's about my position as a driver. So a good room there. Headroom. Well, sunroof opens up, so that's really easy to see how comfortable that is. Here's an angle of what we're looking at from the front cabin. Looks like a 60-40 split. Fold down armrest. Cup holders there. Storage behind the back of the seats for passengers here. USB, gotta like that. You gotta, you gotta have that, don't you, to charge your devices? Spot for a cup holder there. I'm half expecting to have little visors, but these windows are tinted. Oh, turbocharged. Turbo GDI. Let's see. So there's your 60-40 split. Put a light right here. That's kind of cool. Not on that side. So how do you pull those down? It's been a while. An idiot right now. Uh, spare tire down below. Can you get the Everyman driver back here? Oh. Gonna work. Here you go. <laughs> yeah, there you go. How about that? I'll take it. There's my view. So you can get five full-size adults and one everyman driver in the back. This is kind of ridiculous. Let's open it back up. Thank God I had this key fob on me. Oh, there is a safety, safety latch there. 
All right. Ridiculous. Oh, push button here. Now I'm going to yell out for some information. Do you know the price point on this? Price point? 30. Let's go with 30. Do you know the engine on it? It's a guy turbo. Let's go 2.0. If not, I'll have the real information later. Thanks for the help off screen. So there you go. Thing, oh, got the. Uh, I remember this being a new feature on the 17 versus the 16. So there you go, everyone. Saying goodbye to the Honda Civic SI 2017. And hello to the 2017 Kia Sportage All Wheel Drive. And with some of those other features, I might want to take it off road. I'm not sure. Some light duty off roading. I think that would blend in well with the ORV park. What do you think? All right. Thanks everyone for watching. Appreciate it. Uh, thanks for rolling with me on this one and uh, for subscribing. We'll see you a little bit later. Take care. Adios. Hey guys, it's Dave. I just want to say thanks once again for supporting every man driver and watching my videos. Can you do me a small favor? The next time you're in the market for a new or used car and want to schedule a test drive or just want to get a really great price quote from a dealership of your choice in your zip code, click on the link below and fill out a short form. It's car.show forward slash everyman driver. Now it's totally free to you and there's no obligation whatsoever to buy or lease anything. It's just a quick and easy way for you to help support my work and keep this channel going. There's also a free phone number, 844-765-0610, and you can talk to a car segment specialist for car shopping advice and direction. That call is also free to you. The link again, car.show forward slash everyman driver. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again.